Hey YouTube, this next iCast review will be on Colton Hurtis 2020 Capstone uh, Honda for Andretti Autosport with uh, the Steinbrenner Racing Group. And also Harding Racing as well, but they're going away next year. Uh, this is a really cool diecast I picked up from my friends over at Gutsware. I remember getting this a while back. I just never got time to review this until right now. Of course, this is Indy 500 weeks, so of course, you know, I wanted to review this. Um, you know what? It's such a shame about the Indianapolis 500 this year. You know, um, there's no fans allowed at the track this year, unfortunately. Um, I will be back in, in October for the Harvest Grand Prix. Um... You know, it was tough for me to, to not go to the 500 this year. It's, I don't know, it's it's just a shitty, shitty feeling. It really is. Um, I think my, my f frustration, I think, is shared with thousands among thousands among thousands of people. And, um, you know, I didn't, I mentioned this in my Casey Mears review, but I'm going to mention it again, you know, um, I really did not take it well and i think myself david joe and brian you know we're all kind of feeling really down in the dumps about it and you know just to say you know like i'm looking forward to next year already you know winners think big picture and i'm looking forward to next year's race already and um to kind of really accommodate for this year's race I'm actually donating to a uh, local food bank in the town of Indianapolis. I don't know which one yet, but I'm going to figure it out. I know my friend Carol's uh, looking right around for me to see which ones I could donate to because, you know, I, I was going to spend X amount of dollars on tickets, hotels, and race and die cast and all that. So I kind of want to write a little check to these guys, you know, because it, it, it's just the right thing to do. You know, I'm not looking really to gain recognition from it. You know, it's just something that I just feel like I needed to do. So hopefully, you know, my friend Carol will get back to me and we'll be able to contribute a little bit to the uh, the homeless population in Indianapolis because they're suffering a lot. You know, I also remember the also remember the local shops in Speedway, remember the local businesses because they're hurting as well. So make sure to go give them a little love during not only this month but for the rest of the year in general. So, anyways, um, for I'll go on with the box here in a little bit, but I want to just go make sure take a look at the car itself. That's what we all, that's honestly what we all care about the car. We got the Insignature Andretti Chrome Nose. We got Capstone Turbine Corporation. We got Delard, U.S. Concrete, AutoNation, Napa, Gainbridge, DHL, Capstone, Honda, NTT IndyCar Series. We got number eight, got Capstone Turbine. We got Siemens. You got Firestone logos all over the place. I was proceeding on to the side of the car. We got the Harding Racing Group and Steinbrenner Racing Group. We got the Firestone Tires, we got Capstone Turbine Corporation, we got Saf of ba Basif and Sharon Williams, we got the Siemens logo course again on the on the mirrors, got Honda, anti IndyCar Series, got Colton Herta 88, Speedway, powered by Honda, Stratasys, P1, Entity Firestone, Capstone Turbine Corporation, got 88, you got Capstone on the rear wing, there you go. There's the back of the car itself right there. It looks absolutely spectacular. And here you go. This side is the same as the left. Now, overall, this car looks really good. I would really personally recommend this. This was this was one another again. This was, was another one of those top five recommended cars because I was so so excited to get the Colton Herta. I was really just pumped up and excited about it. And this is one I would definitely recommend to all the viewers out there watching this video. This is a real hot seller here. I mean, this is going to be one of those at the end of the year where it's going to be really hard to find. But, you know, the, the livery itself, really, all it is is just the signature Andretti livery, which comes with the tobacco banner and all that, which we could probably flip over to this. Let's see if we can safely flip this over. How can we do that? All right, let's, let's do it this way. Got the signature Andretti banner right from the tub. To the aero screen, all the way to the rear of the car on the engine cover. The aero screen's all colored green. The door so that door fin, excuse me. The roll hoops colored green. The um the TV pods colored a bright day glow orange. Yes, the orange is day glow on this car. Got the tub which is colored white. Rear, the wing plates are colored green and white. Got a little bit of green and um. Flip over to here. 
I've got a little bit of green, orange, and and white on the on the banner. The 88, yes, uh, Mike Harding is a big Dale Jr. fan, so that's why the number is 88. Of course, they took no that now the current font now that Jr. is retired. I uh, got the Airflix, which are colored green and also white on the top of it. The engine cover is all colored green and has got, well, actually, the top is colored green. Then you got a strip of white, a strip of orange. Then it's colored white underneath it. The wing is all colored green. That's what the liver looks like. And quite frankly, I don't know if this looks, this looks off to me. I don't know, but that gearbox looks off to me. That gearbox probably wasn't bolted on straight, but well, whatever. I'm not going to notice it. Um, very cool. You know, I mean, this, overall, the color combo on this car is spectacular. I love the addition of the Day Glow Orange. That's what that's the real big selling point to me. I love the color green. Don't get me wrong. Green's the color of money. Green is a hell of a color. But, you know, it really is the Day Glow Orange that does it for me. I mean, I'm a sucker for Day Glow. Well, of course. Um, this is a really cool car. And you know what? Son of a bitch, this is really awesome. I mean, I was really blown away by this by the prototypes, but you see it in person, it does it justice. Camera don't do it justice at all. You have to get in person to see it. They do. This is available in 164 scale. I reviewed the 164 scale already as is, and go check that out as well. But you know what? This is a real highly recommended product. I really would say definitely pick this up. Um... Comment, like, and subscribe. This is Race H1. I'm reminding you to join the fight and stop bullying. It does get better. The diecast kid is always happy to see you.